down three games to one, heading to Florida for games. A lot of confidence in this room, a lot of motivation in this room, and I couldn't be more excited to get down there and bring it back to Boston. So when Charlie's on top of you there, you're pinned down, you're getting up, he's getting up. Are you thinking in the moment there's no way they can have this goal stand? In the moment, I didn't know what exactly happened. I just know I couldn't play my position, and the review showed that. We have any dialogue with Charlie immediately after that? Like, no, no. I mean, I'm never going to talk to you know, point fingers at all. No, I wasn't thinking point okay. fingers, just thinking about, you know, hey, nothing you could do, nothing and I could I, do. It was just in the moment, and again, Thanks. I know that our guys aren't going to challenge a goal unless they know it's going to get returned, so I was really confident in that. Do you have any explanation from the referee right after? I could ask him. I, all I care about is my team and uh, and talk about us. Are you left in a state of disbelief here over what's happened? Well, it's, it's playoff hockey, and we better believe it because it's reality. And the reality is, is that we're going to go to Florida, and we're going to play the same game, and we're going to get it done. And I have no doubt in this group, and we have a lot of confidence and a lot of motivation to bring it back to Boston because our fans deserve a lot better, and we're excited to do that. Jeremy, you had a hu few huge saves early on. Do you think that provided a spark for your offense to get those early goals? Well, I think... Charlie McAvoy's hit, uh, the pressure that we had right away, that's something that they couldn't handle, and it was evident. And to get two early goals like that is, is extremely important, and especially in our building. I think our fans did a great job rallying behind us, and and you could see the, the ice tilting in our favor. And so, again, we're all pulling the same rope here, and, and it was really special to see that. So obviously we know what we're capable of with our start, and, and I'm excited to see that through for 60 minutes. You've been pretty adamant about the confidence in this group. Overcoming adversity is part of life, part of what you do. Mm -hmm. How confident are you that you, despite what's going on, you can overcome this adversity? Yeah, because it's one game at a time. And we learn from our mistakes. We learn from our, our successes. And uh, what I'm so impressed by this group is, is the way that they keep composed. We keep composed. And we see that there's light at the end of the tunnel. And that team over there knows that. And that's what's really exciting for us is that we know that we could put together a better game. And, and that's what we will do. Does the, fact, one for does the fact that it was Bennett that scored that goal make it a little bit even more frustrating? I don't know. I've scored.